Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to Astro Near. Today, I want to take a look at the truck and uh, what's the other thing? The trade platform. Yeah, that's right. The truck and the trade platform. So right now, I am quickly hauling this uh, resurgible thing back to base on our little rover over here. And we are quite low on power. And dumb enough me, I did not bring along the battery. So yeah, but maybe if we cut through, like taking a bit of a shortcut, you might be able to get back to base. Hopefully. Uh, giant rock in the way. Yeah, got it, got it. I'm a good driver. Yeah, I am totally awesome. And we just ran out of juice. Oh well. You know what, let's go quickly go and grab that battery. If I can find it. Man, this base ex is expanding quite a lot. Ah, there you go. And now let's take the slow journey back. Alright. And there we go. So let us switch around. Not 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 the seat. This thing, the unknown. And pop that guy back on. And it is currently researching. Or not re <laughs> No, not researching. It is um quickly doing its thing. So meanwhile that is charging, let's go ahead and plop this guy on the research table and start researching. So what do we get? And we will get the drill head. Okay, I probably have to go read up on what a drill head is. Hmm. But anyways, today I want to also get a take a look at the uh, fuel condenser over here. Which requires two copper. Alright, but uh, over here is the trade platform. And it requires more and more aluminum. And yeah, I don't really have the aluminum on me, but I do have the raw material called uh, malachite, which we can use. Just want to quickly bring down the music, it's a bit irritating. The malachite which is for copper. So let's go ahead and smelt that down. There we go. Copper. Oh yeah. Now we're rocking. Yeah, there we go. So let's quickly get back and look at the fuel condenser because this guy is very interesting. It's a bit of an interesting uh, type of building this is. I think you use it to... Yeah, wow, okay, that's a lot of power it needs to recharge. But yeah, I think you use this to fill your ships and stuff. Not too sure, but yeah. Anyways, let's go back over here and look at the trade platform. It requires one more aluminum, and I think I've got it. Mm, I don't think so. All right. Let's go ahead and put the copper back over here, wherever you want to fit that. And, uh, yeah, let's just put the power over there. I do have quite a few power nodes on me. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Probably just, you know, stack them wherever. Oh, we can make the drill head right now. Okay, let's go for that. All right. And presto. Um, I don't know what you do with this thing. It's quite odd looking. Yeah. Alright. Uh, let's see if there's anything else. I don't see anything. Yeah, we mostly got all the things. Alright, so what I'm going to do is quickly going to put a cut in here. Go find some re -mat raw material to smelt down into aluminum. And then we'll try to build the trade platform. So, see you guys in a bit. And welcome back, peeps. So, I found another research thingy. Let's see what we will get out of this one. And there we go. It is currently researching. And we got fuel. Okay. Uh, uh, yeah, just put it there. So, let me quickly show you guys this guy. Alright. It's full power, and if we click on it, it starts filling up a giant tank. 
and then you will get the fuel. Let's just wait for it to finish real quick. But yeah, then you get fuel. I don't know. This fuel, this feels like unlimited fuel. If you guys know what I mean. If you can build a couple of them, you can have a lot of fuel. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah. Alright, so I got the... Whoa, okay. That was a bug. Quick 360 no scope there. The laterite. Let us quickly smelt that down for the aluminum. Alright. Smelting. Smelting. And let's get the stuff on our backpack. Uh, I did it again. Why? Is there something wrong with my mouse? Don't know. Trade platform. I'm super curious to see what this thing does for us. Okay. Let's just put the aluminum on the storage and that power over there. So yeah, this is the trade platform. Very interesting. The... Okay, so the yield will be whatever this is. So if we... What can we put on there to trade? Um, organic? If we put the organic there. No yield or anything. I don't want to take the aluminum or anything because that is kind of hard to get. I have to go into the caves and stuff. Huh. Okay, let's just take that off. Let me just see. You know what would be a good idea? Is to use the fuel we get. Alright. The hydrazine. If we can fill that up with stuff, then... Let's see if we get anything out of it. See, yield one for compound resin organic. Yeah. So... This might be a viable option if we can build more platforms. Oh, look at it go! Okay, so... You choose whatever you want to yield. Like, let's say, for instance, the hydrazine I put on. You put it on, you choose your yield, whatever, and just click launch. So, I take it it went into space now. To go trade somewhere. Let's put the organic there. And then you have to wait a while for it to return. Alright. So let's get the fuel con condenser going. Okay. So I wonder how long it takes for it to come back. Oh, here it comes. Okay. So it brought back one resin for one. That feels kind of like a ripoff. Although we're getting that fuel for free though. So, like I said, that might be a viable trade option. I don't know. Okay. So let's go ahead and collect all the, the fuel over here. Like so, like so, and like so. This one will be done momentarily. So let's go back to the trading platform. And slap on these guys and see you how much we get. Alright. Uh, give me that one. And then let's put it on that one. So what will our yields be now? Alright, so four resin. Organic, two hydrazine. Which is kind of a ripoff because we're giving four hydrazine or three hydrazine for two. So that's not very nice, but... Laterite, yeah, we get two of those, which will yield two aluminums for us if we smelt it down. And welcome back, peeps. Sorry about that break. <laughs> Something just came up, but uh, yeah, now we're back. Quickly researching another thing we did find, and it turns out to be more fuel. Okay. So anyways, we are going to build another vehicle base, since this one over here is occupied, the one in the distance. Let's quickly want to grab the aluminum over here. Yeah, that thing is... The other vehicle bay is occupied with the shuttle. So I take it, why don't we just build another one? Get that fuel condenser going. And let's just wait for that guy to... You know, charge up. So over here... We have the trading platform ready to go. 
just gonna add another one. So look at our yield. That is actually pretty cool. We'll send that into space at some point. But I want to take a look at what the truck. Yeah, the truck. All American truck, a Ford. <laughs> See what we'll require. So it was copper. No, it was no, it was um, aluminum. So if we can get that uh, laterite, we can smelt that down. Instead of getting two aluminum, we get three laterite, which in return give us three aluminum. All right, so we have one aluminum over here. Uh, slow walking, slow walking. There we go. Okay. Now, that's copper. I'm just looking for if we don't have any other aluminum going anywhere else. Not seeing anything. Okay. So, just waiting for this guy to return. I'm gonna put the resin back over here. And there we go. Nope. Give me back. There we go. Awesome. So let's get the fuel condenser going. I'm going to keep that running because that is, like I said, a viable option to trade. Alright. Back to the smelter. And let's plop these guys in here. And let's just go. There we go, and there we go. Alright, so... Aluminum over there, aluminum over there. And... This just build! Yeah! yeah let's grab that seat. And wait for this thing to finish up building the truck. Wow, it is... A lot more power than the rover. It's a lot bigger. And let's wait for it to finish up. There we go. So, a three-seater. Interesting. A crane and storage. You know what? I really want to see how this crane would look like. Yeah. But that requires more copper, which we don't really have. We only have, like, one. Yeah. Yeah. Which is odd. No, it's not odd, but it's just depressing. We don't have more. So, anyways, I want to see how this baby performs. Let me quickly go grab that battery. So we don't run out of... Uh, let me just run that fuel condenser. Uh, bug. Mouse bug again. I'm confused. Where am I? Ah, okay, there we go. That. And where is the batteries over there? Let's take it over to the truck. And there we go. Nice. Now let's go for a spin. Oh yeah. Wow. Okay. This thing is way more efficient to drive around in. I don't think it's as fast as the rover. Maybe just as fast or a bit slower. Oh. But the amount of things you can do with this. It'd be great. And that storage. Oh. I just want to check something real quick. Let's just stop. I want to get out. Can we click on the back of it? No, we cannot. Alright, no problem. Alright, guys. So, yeah. I think I've got to end off the episode here. So, thank you so much for joining me here on Astroneer. Hope you guys did enjoy today's episode. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.